the mom. <laughs> This is your well. You read it. Ryan's well, funded yeah. by Ryan H. Yeah. For, For the community from of Angola. Angola Primary School. Yeah. Our story begins here in Kempville, Ontario a small country town about an hour south of Ottawa, Canada's capital. It was just a regular day when six-year-old Ryan Hurljack joined his friends in the grade one class at Holy Cross School. Nancy Prest was in her first year of teaching and wanted to inspire her young students about their place in the world and maybe plant the seeds of sharing and caring. It was during Lent, and we were uh, all the grade ones were saving pennies for the uh, Lenten missions. And I had a sheet of paper from the vice principal that said how much money you could save for what would give the children in Africa. And Brian was really interested in the well. He was interested in the water, and that people didn't have water. So he said, "How much was that well again?" On the sheet it said seventy dollars. He says, "I'm going to save for that." And she explained that people were dying because they didn't have clean water. And in that just gave me a bad feeling inside because if you, I just closed my eyes and opened them again. In that classroom, I would see more than 75 or even 100 things they didn't have. So I went home and begged and begged and begged my mom and dad for, for $70. <laughs> 